Take you all in his fur and just drive him nuts and drive him insane. Make it so he just can't start flopping around like a fish. Yes! Yes! I like it! Well then, have a nice day! This is going my way! This is going my way! Yes! I'm sorry, that is worth a little bit of a dance right there. We got some more cleaning maestros. We're gonna level 60 of our characters. I love it. A boom. And a boom. Level 6 cleaning crew. I love it. <laughs> Woo! Five days left though. Can we get this? I mean, we got so much we still gotta get. So short the long the mother's warm milk. Mm. And we still need a lot of tambourines and cardboards. We need 15 tambourines and mm, 45 cardboard. The two V is fly traps. Okay. It's time to get risky. I'm gonna go put that there. You know what? Whoever is feeling good with red is gonna go to the music room and also get the, into the gym. Anyone who's not, I'm gonna have hang back and do and go to the kitchen. I'm also gonna send some people over to get some Venus fly, fly, fly traps, hopefully. Except for you and Sayaka, you two have to clean. My Dexy cleaners have to clean. I'll send you two, I'll send you three there. You go get milk. Mm. Yeah, I'll send you to get milk. I think this'll do. Okay, cardboard, tambourines, and these white dress and milk. Let's see. Two range we need. We got two milk! Three milk, five! The milk is jumping, we got cardboard, come on, people! Milk is just flying, we need a lot of it though. Cardboard, we got two. Come on, give me what I need! Hmm. Okay, I got a tambourine. Oh, well, let's hang out with someone. That we call just unlucky. Mm. hero time. I should. What we like to do with Chihiro? Of course, it's hang out. We spend time together. Cause why not, right? I'd like to go somewhere and hang out? I mean, if you don't mind. I had with Chihiro for a while. Chihiro and I grew a little closer today! Yay! We tried to give Chihiro a present, of course! What I like to give her? Hmm, what to give? What to give? Um. Something. Give bacon, unfortunately. Some people love bacon. I don't know if she, she does. Look at her max gloves. Arigato. Thank you, Makoto. <laughs> <laughs> this is the first time I've ever gotten something like this. I had the impression that she liked it. That's good. Uh, no. No! What's wrong, Chihiro? It, uh, it hurts. Ah, uh, did you get hurt, Chihiro? Oh well, not really. I got bit by a mosquito last night. A mosquito? Oh, I figured something serious happened since you were saying how it hurt. Huh? Oh, did I give you the wrong impression? So sorry. 
You don't have to apologize. It was my own darn fault. You said it hurts. Did he? Did it really bite you that hard? It yeah. See? Look. She held out her arm, and a huge red lump stood out clearly against her pale skin. Holy cow! She did get you good. It's way past itchy now. It hurts. Why is it so big? Did it bite? Did she bite you while you were sleeping or something? Oh no, I was awake. But you didn't notice? Mm. No, I noticed, but... But what? Um. Well, I felt it bite her bite me and I looked down at her. I didn't do anything. I just sat there and watched her suck my blood. Mosquitoes are mosquitoes that bite a female, by the way. You just watched. Why did you smack it? Cause that would have killed her, right? Well, yeah, but. I mean, it must have been really hungry to suck that much blood. It must be making babies. It must be laying its playing its eggs. If it was that hungry, it would have been really sad not to let it have anything. But it's just a mosquito. It mosquitoes are living things too, though. It might have had its own mosquito family. It'll be making one. Sorry, I know that's dumb, but I played this game called Mr. Mosquito. No, really, you don't have to apologize. And I haven't played that one. I need to play that one day. But don't go scratching, okay? I'll just make things worse. Then, uh, what, if it gets so, what if it gets so much I can't take it? Well, in that case, just take the tip of your fingernail and push it into the bump. That'll help. Oh, I had no idea. <laughs> You're so smart, Makoto. As she said that, she smiled like a tiny, cute little animal. I wonder if she does that on purpose. If so, that's a whole other level of scary. Uh, but anyway, don't you think it's kind of strange? Huh? What it? Oh, well, what is? Uh, well, the school's completely sealed off, right? So how did a mosquito get in? Maybe there's somewhere in here the school where bugs can live and grow. Some kind of nature spot. A nature place in the school? Well, I can't say for sure that there's not. Uh, or, 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 maybe there's a secret passage somewhere that leads out of the school. A secret passage? I mean, there's not. I'm sure we'll get out of here somehow. As long as we all work together, I'm sure we'll be all out of here in no time. <laughs> You're right. Working together is super important. Then, uh, of course, I don't know how I can be useful. I'll probably just weigh you all down. That's not true. It makes me feel way better knowing you're here to help. Uh, it does? Really? Yep, so let's all do our best, okay? Arigato. Uh, okay. <laughs> Thank you, Makoto. Here's the poor guy's update based on experience with her. It's not our skill points has increased. Hey, look at you go. I don't know, Mr. Mosquito, but I'd love to play on my own. Once we're all done, I head back to my for a little while. And I heard it was a fun game, so... And I did see it. At least we play a little bit. This is a school announcement, because I hate you all so much. It's official. It's now officially night time. Get plenty of rest and get ready to work hard again tomorrow. <laughs> Okay then, sweet dreams everyone. Good night, sleep tight, don't let the bed bugs bite like those mosquitoes. God damn Windows 10! It's important that we do our best no matter what the goal is. Kyo seems to be feeling pretty good. That's good for us, good for her, good for everybody. Okay. <laughs> Yes! Cleaning Maestro's for days! Another level up! Yes! Level 7 cleaning crew! I love it! I love it so much! Well then, have a nice day! I'll give you a level, and I'll give you a level. Level 7 cleaning crew! Hmm, none here. 
Got three more cardboard. Hmm. It's gonna be close. It's gonna be a mission. I don't need a long mop right now. I need a small vacuum at the moment, that's for sure. Ooh, mom's warm milk. I need that. I'll make two of them. And I'll use one of them right now. We'll see what happens. That is the effect of mother's warm milk. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> See, I'll put those there. Put leave those there. I'll bring you here as well. I'll give us a bit of supply traps. I'll bring you here. And hmm, we got one left. Yeah. I like this better. Attack! Yoko! She's gone nuts, so oh, that's great! One damn marine, two cardboard, four. Two. Oh, come on, some of the kitchen knives. Come on, more tambourines and more cardboard. Four cardboard, two tambourines. What I like to do is go meet with someone, because why not? Let's work with the same person we have been working with. What we like to do with your hero? Spend some time together. Go somewhere and hang out? I mean, if you don't mind. I had with your hero for a while. Of course, because why not? Jira and I grew a little closer today. I'll give her a present. Because why not? Let's give her. Hmm. Decisions, decisions. What should I give her? What should I give her today? Um, hmm. Hmm, I guess I can give her one of these. Thank you, Makoto. <laughs> First time I've ever gotten something like this. I get the impression that she liked it. That's good. Uh, what's wrong? That seems like a pretty heavy sigh. Oh, sorry. It's just everyone else is working so hard to get us out of here, but I'm no help at all. That's not true at all. It's okay. You have to try and make me feel better. I know it's the truth. I'm completely useless with that computer in front of me. At least if I were a little stronger or something, then I'd be able to help somehow. Listen, you'll get your chance. I'm sure there'll be a time when your skills will come in handy. So you don't have to worry mu so much, okay? Uh, My skills might come in handy. <laughs> if I get a chance, I'm going to work super hard to chip in. Because of computers, you can count on me. Forget about that, no matter what anyone might say, you're still the ultimate programmer. Speaking of which, how'd you get into programming? Uh, huh? Well, I mean, I always assume most programmers were guys, so... Is it really that weird? No, nothing like that. I'm just curious what got you interested in it. I mean, why programming of all things? Why? I mean, there isn't much of a reason. I've always been kind of weak, you know? I was never able to run around with my friends or anything. We had a computer at home, so I'd kill the time poking around with it. Oh, no. 
that's about it. My dad was a software engineer, and he had a bunch of programs that on there that he built. I found one of them and started playing around with it, adding stuff here and there. And that was how I ended up making my very first program. Interesting, what kind of program was it? What kind of database software? Database software? Like excess. The user could communicate with it and it would take that information and find what they were looking for. It's a way of interacting with the computer without having to physically type things out. So you can understand the user without them having to type things out. So that would have to be voice recognition. It makes sense, right? Use voice recognition, is that it? <laughs> yep, exactly! You could talk to it and it could actually talk back. It was a lot of fun. It didn't even really sound like me. I could totally absorb into talking to it. It was like a kid recording itself and playing it back again. It the key part of the program was getting it to recognize what I was saying. The recognition of accuracy was the most important thing. Japanese is kind of hard, so it was pretty challenging. But you're able to do it eventually, and hi, DCOM. So that yep, and right around then, my dad found out I messed with the software without permission. I thought I was going to get in so much trouble. <laughs> but all he said was how impressed he was. The software was able to make, take natural speech and put out key search terms to retrieve information. My dad said it worked so well, it was going to change the face of software interaction all over the world. The development cost is still pretty expensive, so it hasn't spread that much yet, but... Anyway, I've been addicted to programming ever since. <laughs> I can't tell you how happy it's made me to be able to make others happy. It's obvious how much you love computers. You seem to just light up when you start talking about them. Uh, sorry, I spent all the time just talking about myself. No, I had a lot of fun learning more about you. Plus, everyone's seen her about me. Huh? Really? Yep, I hope you'll tell me even more next time. <laughs> okay, let's hang out again sometime. It's a promise, okay? Do you have the report card has been updated based on your experience with her? You have like the skill algorithm. Give yourself a pat on the back. You've earned it. I part ways with Chihiro and went back to my room. Ahem, this is a school announcement. It's now officially nighttime. Get plenty of rest and get ready to work hard again tomorrow. Okay then, sweet dreams everyone. Good night. Sleep tight. Don't let the bed bugs bite. Nibble nibble. Man, that's not too bad. I'll, get, I'll recover that. <laughs> I feel like I can jump in the ocean and swim around the entire coast of Japan! You seem to be feeling pretty good. You know, I'm gonna do something different. I'm getting the episode here instead this time, but first, let's see how we're doing. Ooh, let's see, it's 7 and we need 20. Uh, this is gonna be very, very hard. Okay, I'm gonna think about this and I'm gonna end the episode here. Next episode will continue on, okay? I hope you have fun and I'll see you on the next one. Today's lucky student profile happens to be the waifu of the project, Kyoko Kirigiri. Her variability, which we'll do in a second, I just wanna mention that. She was the one that kind of carried us through the game. And her free time events were probably the ones that really broke the game later on for us. So she can be a little game breaking. But she's also good to have. Her variability is in chapters 1 through 3. She has 5 pages in her report card. Her answers are swimming for the second time because she references Hina. And gloves for the fourth time because, well, you know, I did mess it up during the main game. You know, it was kind of a you know. Her happy heart event is negation, and there's nothing I can do. And her ending is, what? What? Oh, the Let me do that again. What you've already lost. Yeah, I just fumbled that. It happens, guys. Don't worry. 
I am reading this off the actual card, and I do still do it. Just laugh with me. Let's keep going. Our gifts are, for the best gifts, Civic Coffee, number 3, Blueberry Perfume, number 21, Rose and Vitro, number 46, Cherry Blossom Bouquet, number 47, Bojobo Dolls, 80. I always, call, I always said another anime with that one on accident. And the good gifts, Host Peak Ring, number 20, Glasses, number 25, Gold Garden, number 52, Self Destructing Cassette, number 54, Antique Doll, number 59, The Fun Plane, number 67, Voice Changing Bow Tie, number 82, and Meteorite Arrowhead at 87. And now, it's our favorite time, the trivia time! Among the female characters, Kyoko is actually the most difficult to create. She was planned to be a mysterious girl from the very beginning, but due to the psycho pop style, her monotone closing to fit the idea kind of changed. So, they based her design on purple tones, and so I was giving her a cello pet skirt design and gloves, which they did keep the gloves for from playing stages. They added a, a double jacket to increase her role as a detective. That's kind of where everything starts out. There's also a hard time deciding between Kyoko's current hairstyle and a shorter one. Both styles look nice if you see the beta designs, which I'm going to show. He suggested a haircut you see in the middle of the game, however the idea was left unused. But they went along here, technically because she's set up as a double heroine with Sayaka. So it's kind of a shared feature between the two. But since she's a heroine, heroine that survives the end, her design took time and Rui grew to like it quite a bit. She was always cold towards Makoto though, so I'm not sure how a good how good a heroine she is, she the designer adds, which is Rui. Remember me mentioning her name a few times. There's not much I have because Except for being the first victim in the beta version of Danganronpa, which kinda kinda makes sense and kinda funny. They swapped her. There's really only one thing other than what I've already mentioned. Is that the very first trailer for Ultra Despair Girls, the original release, it begins teasing by saying that the upcoming song in the Danganronpa series is a sports game, which shows Kyoko playing basketball. It's kind of funny that they did this, because Yoko Hikasa is known for a role in the basketball theme series, Robe Kyobu has Saki Nagasuka. And she's also part of a five group pop group with the same name, along with four of her fellow voice actresses, who also portray part of the series' main cast, so this is kind of a shout-out to that. They often like to do stuff like that. They'll do funny jokes like that. It's something I've seen before and other things. But there's really not much for her. She's still a mystery. Congrats, Kyoko. Most Mysterious Character Award goes to you, as well as Best Waifu for this project. You won two awards for going through the game like this. I'm getting the episode here, so I hope you have fun, and I'll see you on the next one.